So guys, for the first step, you want to head over to search and then type in view network connections. Click on it. You want to find your network adapter. You want to take a note of the name. Now we're going to head over to search and then type in device manager. Click on it. Now once we're on this, we're going to expand network adapters. And then you want to find the same network adapter with the same name. You want to right click on it, click on update driver, and then click on search automatically for drivers. Make sure that the best drivers your device have been installed. Now for the second step, you want to head over to search again and then type in services. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on any service and then click on W on your keyboard. Now we're going to look for Wi-Fi direct services. Here it is right here. You want to double click on it and then change the startup type to automatic and then click on start. And then click on OK. Now we're going to scroll down till we find Windows Update. Here it is. You want to double click on this as well. Make sure that the startup type is on automatic and then click on start which will then make it running. Now for the last step, you want to head over to search again and type in view network connections. Now once you're on this, you want to find your network adapter again. You want to right click on it and then click on disable. Then you want to right click on it again and then click on enable. Now once it's been enabled, you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.